everyone and welcome to my July empties. So I kind of try and do these probably every two months or so and I talk you through the products that I have completely used up and whether or not I would repurchase. So I've got a bag right here next to me that my boyfriend yesterday found and said, why have you got a bag of rubbish sat under the chair in the bedroom? And I was like, no, 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 it's not. It's for an empties video. And he was like, you're filming a video about your rubbish and I was just like it's not my rubbish it's my empties they just don't understand but I am going to jump into my rubbish slash empties first thing is a kind of um hair mask I suppose you'd call it and this is from the sanctuary and it's the detox hair exfoliant so it's supposed to kind of help to um detox your scalp I wouldn't repurchase this I got kind of two goes out of this um and I think it's two pounds but it just wasn't really my kind of thing it didn't really do much for my scalp I always feel like I've got product builds up on my scalp no matter what I use this was no exception it was kind of quite gritty and it just didn't feel like it did much so I won't be repurchasing that then I have got a body butter. I've actually got two body butters, so I'll do them at the same time. I've got this one from Soap and Glory, and this is the Righteous Butter. This is my favourite Soap and Glory scent, I think, bar the um, Sugar Crush. It's just so sweet and Soap and Glory-like, but I've used that up completely. I will repurchase this at some point. I really like it. And then I've also got the... I've had this for absolutely ages. It took me forever to use this. It's the Botanics Nourishing Body Butter, and I've used it all up. Up. it's kind of a very thick very moisturizing gives your skin that lovely glow type of product but it is um, not the easiest product to get through because it's so thick so I would buy it again um, if I was ready for that kind of commitment I'm not sure that I am as of yet then what else have we got here um, I've got a kind of funny random one that I think this is probably why my boyfriend thought that this was rubbish. This is the Febreze Air Effect Soothing Sandalwood. Yes, it's kind of like an air freshener, but the reason I wanted to discuss this with you was because it's my absolute favorite air freshener. And I know that's not necessarily beauty related, but I wanted to mention it anyway. And it smells amazing. I smell it, I smell it. I spray it all over um, the bedding, all over the sofas, just kind of generally in the air. And I love, love, love the smell of it. This is my absolute favourite one. We kind of have a bit of a discussion going on. My boyfriend thinks that the Cotton Fresh one is the nicest sandalwood all the way. Then I have got a empty thing of the heel gel and I will confess that I haven't um, used this completely by myself. My boyfriend uses this as well. He does have quite dry skin and he really, really liked it. I would have it again. I've got the intense version on the go at the moment and I do really like it. It's just kind of like a nice in-between product, especially if your skin's feeling a little bit dehydrated. Then another sanctuary thing. This is the body wash. This was in one of those kind of gift sets I got after Christmas. I like this. I don't think I'd repurchase it. It kind of had little scrubby bits in, but they didn't really work that well. And um, I love the scent. I love the scent of all Sanctuary products, but I didn't feel like it really did much for me. So I would prefer to spend my money on kind of other shower gels. Then another Sip and Glory product. This is Peaches and Clean. And you can see I have got a tiny bit left in here. But because of how the packaging's made, I can't really get that out. I might cut it and scoop it out. But then you've got it lying around. And I've already started a new one, so I'm not too bothered. I don't think I would repurchase. Um, I would repurchase it, but I don't think I'd have to repurchase it for a while now because I've already got a new one on the go. Really like this. Um, if you haven't ever tried it and you've got quite hardy skin, really, really good one. Then I've got shampoo, and this is the Boots Expert Build Up Removal Shampoo. I do really like this. It is really effective. The only thing is, is that it's kind of got a really horrible smell it smells a bit like chlorine I'm not the biggest fan of that but I would um, repurchase it it's very inexpensive and it kind of does help to clear up your scalp a little bit then I've got a product here that I love and I'm nearly out of this so I thought I would include it because I've probably got only like two more goes out of it and this is the L'Oreal Skin Perfection um, Advanced Correcting Serum I love this as my kind of morning serum it's amazing I'm not going to repurchase it just yet because I've got about six other serums that I've kind of got on the go at the moment that I want to try and use up before, but I definitely will repurchase this at some point. I love it. I love the packaging. I just love everything about it. I think it's amazing. 
and then also one that I've got just like one more use out of is the Smashbox Photo Finish Oil Free Primer. I've had this forever, it lasts forever. I wouldn't repurchase it, there's others that I like more, but it's kind of, it's nice. I'm wearing it under my foundation today, like I said, it's not my favourite ever, but it's quite nice. And then I've got a fake tan that I've used up. This is the Coco Brown One Hour Tan love this stuff i've done a full review of it i'll link that down below it develops in three hours beautiful color just wish it was slightly darker and lasted a bit longer but i would definitely purchase it it's really inexpensive you can buy it on full unique and you can buy it in primark now as well it's really really lovely great if you haven't ever used a fake tan before as well and then i've also got a kind of youtube cult classic back from when i started watching youtube and this is the neutrogena visibly clear two in one I crack this out whenever my skin's having a little bit of a breakout kind of issue. I don't use it all the time, it's a little bit too drying for me all the time, but every now and then I feel like it makes my skin just clear up um, a little bit faster. It's packed with kind of um, breakout fighting ingredients and it's a really lovely product, kind of clay based, very cooling and just one of those products that I like having in at all times. So definitely would repurchase that. And then I've got two more and I'm dropping everything two more and then we're done another Soap and Glory product I'm proper on it with Soap and Glory today this is the Mist You Madly Soft and Sexy Fragrant Body Spray I don't know if I would repurchase this it smells really lovely like really really lovely and I did really like it I kind of spray it on myself after I've had a shower and that kind of thing but there are others that I'd like to try maybe I'd come back to it at some point but um, it's not my kind of favourite favourite ever I don't think I have a favourite ever to be fair though and then last but not least is another shower gel and this is from the body shop and it's their Coco Mania shower gel which looks like this I would repurchase this again I really like the body shop shower gels I think they're really fragrant and lovely and I might go and buy myself a new one when my oh no I won't go and buy myself a new one because I've got a massive type of philosophy that I want to finish up first so yeah those are my July empties I hope you enjoyed this video let me know if you want me to continue to do July um to do July <laughs> end July now let me know if you want me to do more empties in the future I know that they're kind of quite popular and that you guys enjoy them and yeah I would love to know what kind of the most difficult product for you to finish up is like makeup I never finish makeup I gave my friend a foundation that was too light for me a while ago and then she said to me oh I used up that foundation you gave me and I was like excuse me you used it up like empty and she's like yeah I've never ever 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 done that so yeah clearly I've got issues but I hope you enjoyed this video I am going to love you and leave you now and don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you liked it really appreciate it and I'll see you in my next one bye